My name is Christina Merriweather, and I serve as the chair of the Black History Month Steering Committee. On behalf of the committee, I welcome you to Black History Month at RCC. Every February, we use this time to reflect and celebrate the great achievements of African Americans, both locally and nationwide. For those who may not be familiar with the origins of this commemoration, Black History Month first began as Negro History Week and was started by Dr. Carter G. Woodson in 1926 as a way to normalize celebrating the contributions of African Americans to American society. It was then nationally recognized by President Gerald Ford in 1976 with a charge to, in his words, seize the opportunity to honor the too often neglected accomplishments of Black Americans in every area of endeavor throughout our history. Each year, the RCC Black History Month Committee has selected a theme to center our programming on. And this year, in addition to celebrating the art, literature, music, food, and social and political contributions of Black people, we are also pleased to contribute to the ongoing discussion about health and wellness as it impacts the African diaspora. We invite you to join us in the many conversations we will have about the Black community's journey to mental, physical, and spiritual wellness throughout the decades. Whether it's attending one of the readings of Black literature during our African American literature reading, or grabbing a snack and watching a screening on the history of soul food or the Black church, or burning some calories at the Fit Hop demonstration, there is something for everyone, whether you're a student, faculty member, or staff member. Please check out our events and mark your calendars. We need everyone to get involved in the conversation and the celebration because Black history is American history.